Mm. Hello, everybody right, here yes. on YouTube, and welcome. We open Natalie. Natalia, the primal storm. Natalia. <laughs> <laughs> I had my friend Natalia only knew. There we go. Natalia, the primal storm is great. Six mana, six yeah, six on attacks. I played with Draw this card two cards and, and play them both. Busted. It was busted. I mean, sometimes you hit lands, but it's still a very, very good card. I had a I had a deck where I uh, I, I attacked with Natali and I hit on um mm, jealous. What is that? Turkey? Jerky? This turkey? is a buffalo buffalo jerky. Uh body, buddy, I am doing coverage of GP Vegas is the next one that I will be going at. Um I had a chupacabra off of Itali, it was amazing. Feels good, man. Oh yeah, that that's that is great. Yeah, it was good. So I guess I was awful. What is the appeal? It's just like really easy meal. Like when you s spend like five hours on stream, like me, and you do it during one of the times when you would have been having a meal. A lot of times it's just like not something you have to plan for. It's just like a very easy thing to do. I I use Soylent uh, every day just because no, use it. It's not even like food, you know. It's, yeah, it's, <laughs> uh, I, I use it. Just, basically, uh, it's just so I can get up later. I just use it for breakfast. <laughs> Molly is right. Soylent is a too lazy to attack of meals. Yeah, too lazy to cook no. Soylent. So I kind of want to take Dusk Legion Zella. I don't know. I've been really impressed with that card. I might take Atsukan Seer. Really? Is it that good? Good with Atali. It ramps Atali out and then gets it back. But I think that Atsukan Seer is... Look at the colors is, on these. Yeah, but Inaya Dinos is, is, a, great, is a great deck. Uh, you could also take Goblin Trailblazer. I think I'd take Trailblazer over to Zealot, just because there's no reason to go into a second color. Sure. I like I like all of those things. The I'll Seer, the I think, is, is a premier cats card. Cats and Snacks. How about Boots and Cats? Boots and Cats and Boots and Cats and Boots and Cats. Hmm. Hunt the Week is really good. Yeah, I'll take Hunt the Week. Boots and Cats. And... How hmm. good is this card? I think, I think it is quite good in the right deck. This is not the best place for it, but I still think it's a good card. I actually like Strength of Pack a lot. Should we just still take it? it? I think so. I think it's better than the Pioneer. Boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats and... Just... This isn't as sweet, but I would take the Trailblazer. Trailblazer this time? Yeah. It's weird to splash for, like, the ramp card. Yeah, you might end up not doing so. Ooh, Baffling End is good. Night of the Stampede is really good, Yeah, I'm good, excited though. about this guy. This guy, pop yeah. out this guy? Yeah, I'm in for that. Ideally, you're green, white, splashing red, even though it's a double red card. But. Strength is best in red folk. I can see that. It's kind of counterintuitive that there's all these, like, dinos in the art of it. <laughs> uh, does it not annoy you that Hunt the Week is a strictly worse version of the same card? No. Savage Stomp's uncommon. Hunt the Week's common. Hey, Hawkman, how are you? Any tips before Indy this weekend? Uh, ask Louise. He will have good advice. But are you going to be there? Um... Hawkman, I haven't seen you in so long. Am I going to be an indie? I think so. No, Hawkman. Oh, yeah, there's a Dreadmaw. Evil Wild? Just get in there. Really? I would just take Colossal Dreadmaw. I like Colossal Dreadmaw. I think this card's good. Really? Hmm? Isn't this better when we have this? Hmm. I would take Dreadmaw. But... We have three six drops already. Yeah, but you have a... Night of the Stampede. And a Seer. They're basically four drops. I think it's close. Ooh, Tillinali's Tillin crown. crown. This card's great. No, I would take the Armasaur. <laughs> <laughs> I am done putting Tillinali's crowns on creatures that aren't excellence, by the way. That, that, oh, yeah. It's happened way too many times for me. Like, I will not be doing that this weekend, I don't think. Unless it's like, do it or bust, you know? Man, it's gonna be great. This... It's gonna be great. I'm gonna finish my rounds and just leave, and it'll be great. You can't. Would you be mad? I'd be furious. <laughs> You'd be leaving to do what? What is your goal? Like you. <laughs> uh, if yeah. I recall correctly, at all times you would just leave and find me, who's clearly still playing, because I play way slower than you. You also just play so fast. I don't understand how. I. I... You play Magic so fast. It is unbelievable. And people who see you play on stream don't see it. It's not the same as when you're playing Paper Magic. It is not the same. It's like very different because I think I, when I, you're I on told... stream, you're on stream, you play fast, and that's obvious. But 
you play so fast when you're playing in paper and then you're also, there's no stream, so you're not like dirtling or talking to people. It's unreal. I, I told the story many times, but I still really like it that when uh, Shota Yasoka and I played in the top eight of the PT in Shadows, they told us to play slow. Shota, like, I think Shota plays faster than Luis. You know, but Shota plays so fast. He is another person where I just don't understand it. Just this guy, maybe? Is that better than the Guild Glove? Guild Glove sucks in this deck. Mm. I'd rather just Firebrand. So, one of the- Hey, Sydney, what's up? Sydney, how are you? Welcome. It's so good to see you. You guys, Sydney's on my stream team. You should check him out if you haven't. He streams a lot of variety, but he's been playing a lot of Warframe lately. Indy is team limited, yes. I, when I was working and doing coverage at the Pro Tour, um, I had some rounds where I had to do to spot the players and the spotters are basically the people who stand you don't see them anymore in coverage they they have like made it so that you can't see them anymore uh, I think I'd rather do you take, want to wrap I think plummet is I think nice. I'd rather have a sideboard card than this guy this yeah, guy's so derpy yeah just like raptor IRL <laughs> that's mean raptor IRL is not derpy you know but <laughs> that's true uh, raptor's gas yeah raptor is great so raptor bought me this hat <laughs> you actually look really cute in that hat. <laughs> Naya seems to think so too. <laughs> yes, she keeps literally telling me to put the hat on. Like she's very limited command of the of the, of the human language or English language yeah. rather, and it does does do that. I'll take the derpy dino now. I was like seeing spotters streaming. Yeah, they don't, they don't, you can't see the spotters anymore. They they have made it so that the spotters aren't on the other side of the camera. So you can't see them when they're spotting there anymore. But I had a match where I spotted Shota versus like Luis was on the other side and Shota was playing a control deck and he had, oh my gosh, I want to, Luis, what, what match could you have possibly been playing against Shota where he had a card where he was drawing like three extra cards a turn? Uh... He was playing his Esper control deck. What card was he, letting him draw three cards a turn? He, he just had card draw in his deck, like just you know, it was random just card, draw. card draw. Yeah. Okay, well, basically every turn was like draw, then cast a spell, then draw two cards, then cast another spell, draw a couple more cards, and then in the meantime he's like played all the things he's played, and then when he's done playing, he doesn't even hold his cards up. He just puts his cards down. So then you're like, ah, oh, I'm like five cards behind and, and, and you know your thing is outdated. So if they ever like show your, your view for like what Shota's hand is, it's just like from two turns ago. So then the next time he goes up, you're like trying to go, like trying to catch them all. And you're trying to predict which ones he's trying to play. So you don't actually write them in because by the time he's played them, they're obsolete, you know? <laughs> it was horrible. Oh yeah, that that Bimran, that's a good good link. God, that's just me getting browned, isn't it? <laughs> uh I think I wanna hunt the weak here. Like we're not playing uh, big Yeah, yeah, I would for big sure. Big dino, hunt. right? Any restaurants for suggestions for Kyoto? Uh yeah. Oh geez, you you were in the booth for this. Me? It was you and Randy. <laughs> what happened? God, you look so different. Do I have black hair? No. Your hair is just much longer, though. I miss my long hair. Are we, are we going to end up with loose dinosaurs again? You actually have payoffs here this time. I really like playing that, that deck, but yeah. John Ooh, another Knight of the Stampede. That card is really good. It does everything you want. It's a 2-4 yeah, blocker dude. and ramps out Getting your things. Getting this guy out fast seems like it's like the most important thing we can do with this Also game. good with Hunt the Week. It's a 2-4. Hunt the Week is kind of nice on that. Mm, I might just take the 2-drop. Yeah. It, 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 it gets a... Uh, it does pretty well with Hunt the Week. Frilled Death Spitter is fine, but I think the 2-drop is better. Being able to fight as a 2-4 I think is pretty nice on your own turn since it's a sorcery. It's like a nice mondo combo. But he's still, oh my gosh, Luis, down this down. is the match where I remember getting scolded for calling Kalitas, uh, Kalitas. Oh my god. Kalitas. I, 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 Ka Gooby so remembers. <laughs> oh wow, yeah, my hair's, wow, my hair's so long. I look so different, damn. 
You you remember every time in your life you've been scolded though, so. Yes, because it doesn't happen very often. You look so different too. You're wearing glasses. Yeah. Yeah, I, I got scolded for calling it uh, Kalitas instead of Kalitas. We got scolded too because what what showed it I will do. Ooh, Reckless Rage is actually good in this deck. It's good with Hardy Veteran and Knights of the Stampede. Hardy that Veteran is, is super nice with this. All right. Yeah. Um, is like, Shota will like, if one of us like has the win and just starts it, the other person will just scoop like, oh yeah, or I'll just like show him something and he knows I'll untap and do it. We don't really like make each other go through all of it, but they did not like that for coverage because it is actually bad for it coverage. It is actually bad for coverage. You should know that too. You should know better. You should know better. Calc! Calc knows the timeout life. He was born in the timeout life. Bred in the timeout life. It's just really easy to timeout when you're streaming. Uh, depends who you're talking about, I guess. I've never timed out. You know, you know that it is common for streamers to timeout. You do know that, right? Yeah, I mean, I, I can believe it. It, it. There's a lot of, uh, you know, people who maybe inexperienced or just for a, 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 I'll stop. I'll stop while I'm like pretty far ahead. You're not far ahead, just FYI. Just a death spitter. You can play it on turn five with a Knight of the Stampede. Knight, death spitter, bam. I don't think this Atsakan Seer is getting in there right now, but who knows. Ooh, Bex, Breast Breakfast Brunch is a French place called Auberge. I've actually, I think, been there. We went to actually a place in, uh, a, a food place in Kyoto or Tokyo that had really good breakfast. It was like... Yeah. Was I don't remember the name anymore, but I was actually thinking about it the other day. It was so good. We, we went there twice, actually. It was very good. Hey, Cherish Hatchling. I don't actually know if that's better than Hardy Veteran, even in the Dino deck. Well, we do have... Oh, we didn't have two Reckless Rage. We, we picked up the Fire Spitter. Because you could have picked up two Deathless Rage. What? There, there wasn't another Reckless Rage in that pack, was there? I think there might have been, yes. Really? Maybe. I don't think so. Maybe I would have been crazy. There's, I'm, I'm probably, there's no I'm way we would have not taken being, the Reckless Rage. I'm probably being crazy. I'm probably being crazy. Hmm. I mean, I'm like not fully paying attention, but I didn't think... Uh... <laughs> All right. I still think Hardy Veteran. I just don't think you're going to end up with that Dino happening very well, often. I think the Warzaka Raptor, I think he's a punk face, and I think he's bad. Yeah, you might play it, but I I don't know. Ooh, Cacophon, we did This is a much better thing to play than this. Yeah. Also, it's free with Reckless Rage. Yeah, it was a one-mana 2-2 two -two pirate. I did, I did see that. There's a Reckless Rage. There we go. Wow, wow. we have the two hardy veterans. But pow Yeah, Reckless uh, three. Even. Reckless Rage is so good in this deck. That's an embarrassingly like Golden Demise, too. We're not getting there on the Seer. No, but that's okay. I, I like the way this this deck is so much better than the other deck, and we have the pack left it's still. It's probably just a hat. You realize that your yeah. hat has just brought us good luck and goodwill. Mm. I hope so. Man, seeing that old coverage thing is wild. Horncrest. Yeah, this deck is this deck is getting there. I'm I'm into it. Here, if you want to, the, the best video from Shadows of Rainstrike is this one for sure. Let me see it. Are you thinking Yokai did it? And only there was a Yokai that made me not snore. Hello and welcome to. Oh my gosh, I want to play it on screen in a second. It's so funny. I'll do it. Hold on. I need to transfer it from computer to computer, so I need to put it in the chat. Well, accept Gabby to play a vintage challenge on stream. I mean, that's kind of like, or convince Gabby. That's kind of up to her. Like, I'm happy to do whatever when I'm a guest on the stream. But how about be nice and respectful to the stream and, and myself? I, I'm, I'm, I, like, I'm like I said, I'm happy to do almost anything. I'm a guest on the <laughs> almost anything has been called. God denied. My goodness. All right, hold on. I just wanted to transfer it from computer to computer. Okay, I have it on my other computer. We can look at it in a sec. Ooh, fanatical firebrand. You can also target reckless rage on the firebrand and then shoot their thing in response. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, because you just need a legal target. Hmm. All right, you guys, I'm going to show you an amazing video in a second. Uh, After we reserve El Monstrosoro. Yeah, all right, we have it reserved, and now I can show you.
Welcome to coverage of Pro Tour Shadows over Innistrad. We get to watch Hall of Famer and currently undefeated player in the tournament, Luis Scott Vargas, <laughs> manage his way through the Shadows over Innistrad draft. And I'm really curious to see where Luis goes here. Yesterday, he drafted Black Red Vampires, and it was an amazing deck. He gave it a 10 out of 10, and he did really well with it. He looks like he's opened up a Lightning Axe here. Yet. Yeah, Lightning Axe is just one of the best red uncommons, one of the best uncommons, period. Great way to start a draft. Yeah, he's picked up another very powerful uncommon here, Ian. He's got a Near Heath Chaplain pulled to the front. That's a, is that a Fever Visions? Visions? That's an exciting pulled. card. I'm All loving right. this, Marshall. This is great. This is a great start to a draft. Put on your seatbelts, kiddos. This one, he could go very Too quiet, here. people are oh. saying? The, the video is quiet because I have this bumped up to 100, and I have this at 100, too. I can bump, okay, I can bump the Elgato again. Uh, all right, here we go. Another oh. Fevered Visions! Whoa. <laughs> <gasps> oh, man. This is an awesome start. One second, let's make a pick. Just, Fire, Fire Cannon Blast has to be better than Till and Ollie's Night, right? I don't think so, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah for sure. <laughs> oh, man, I can't wait to see where this goes. He's gonna take a rush of adrenaline here. He picks up a port town here. Well, an insolent neonate here. Yeah, these last couple picks haven't been thrilling. A lot oh, of this is going to hinge on what he opens in the next couple picks of the next pack. Ghostly wings there for Louise. Another card that... I can't control them separately, you guys. They're coming from the same place, so I have to lower both of them. Nothing? A daring sleuth or a halpack wolf were those the two best choices, really? Mm. Ugh. Not a good open here for Louise. <laughs> You know, that's still <laughs> sacrificing a clue is going to be pretty tough for him to actually get it transformed into bearer of overwhelming truths. All right, let's see if he picks up something a little better here. Oh, no. Yeah, these are... One second. Uh... The Shauna's Wayfinder? Not ideal cards for him to be picking this early. Is Luis forced to just take an Ember Eye Wolf here? I think he might be. Oh, and, and he is going to be miserable. <laughs> yeah, I think so. He's just got to be, I don't know. <laughs> getting that sinking feeling right now, but which, which is, you know, definitely a reasonable plan here. And I think given how the packs have, break, have broken for him, um, sort of his only realistic option. Uh oh. That, that is wow. a path that he could go down here. This is just absurd. He is just <laughs> nothing here. He's got an inner struggle, which is a perfectly fine. Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> I've come to talk with you again. Because a vision saw me. <laughs> I love this part. That's so good. I love that video. It's so good. It is, it is absurdly good. Yeah, uh, it's great. I might Sun Crown Hunters here with double Knight and double Hunt the Week and double Reckless Rage. You can just like kind of just. I did two one. I, I actually like. It was. Actually, it was a, deck it, ended up it, good. it was like. I feel like you were like Neo in the Matrix two one with a deck, just like. Whoosh, I feel like I was set up to have an actual really good deck, and my deck ended up so bad, but I did escape with a, with a good record. A I might whip tail here, yeah. Yeah, with a real gun. Yeah, whip that tail back and forth. Mm. Uh, Stupid you could take your friend. Face? Uh, oh, yeah. You could probably cut Otsukon oh, Seer. Ooh, better. Raptor Hatching is so good. With double Reckless Range, too. Ooh, Deep Deeper Warrior. Deeper Warrior's not bad. What was it you called it? Excuse you. That is you <laughs> who calls it that, okay? That's, no, it <laughs> that's not me. <laughs> Didn't your neighbor force your black cards and hook you up? Yeah, I don't... What happened in the draft, please? I honestly don't know. I couldn't figure it out. Like, I got so unlucky. I was second picking Ember Eye Wolves and, like, just getting completely destroyed. I... Luis calls it that. I have never called it such a thing. I was so worried I was going to say it on coverage. It was, it was so <laughs> <laughs> B, welcome.
Welcome, B. How are you, B? Oh, Ark, if you if you stop by my stream, you 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 might have some flair. Uh. <laughs> wow, smart. Mm, ooh, this Tillinolli's knight. Oh wow. There's also a dagger tooth. Uh, Tillinolli's knight's gotta be better because we didn't get there on Asakensia, right? Yeah. And we're probably not playing stupid Dino Phase. Till Tillinolli's knight. Yeah, I like Tillinolli's knight. You would love like one more dino. Things are, you got hooked up here. Oh, yeah, I did. Oh yeah, Molly. I I, I got a horn dog reference in on coverage. How did you do that? Oh yeah. When did you do that? That this was at um. I mean, it, it had to it had to be, Ammon Cat. Uh. Yeah, it was gas. Uh. You could probably take out fanatical firebrands. Hey, what's up, Sir Rhino? Hey, Sir Rhino. Welcome. How are you? B, I got your email. I'm still thinking about it because I'm not sure what the best way to do that is. But we'll see. I don't know about that, Calc, but I will see you in line next time. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. Commune. So if you take out the two firebrands and maybe even like the, the Goblin Trailblazer... Wow, we still have to cut cards. This deck is like, oh, Swaggering Corsair looks looks medium. Where is Swaggering Corsair? The uh, three drop. Yeah. Oh, is it medium? We have a ton of two drops. Yeah, but I mean, it's, it's still not like I think your your deck's just really good. I don't think that like a three mana three three necessarily would make it. Whereas Death Spitter at least enables the Tillanali's Knight and is good at the two Knight of the Stampedes. That's fair. We still need to cut one more. Is this any good? I think it's okay. Like we have some. You could cut. Sixes. You could cut. Cough it on. Sure. It's like we have a lot of fours and like everything else is pretty good. Like these are. You have perfect. seventeen creatures with four removal spells, and a pump spell. This looks about right. Yeah, because we want more twos for the hardy veterans. Oh, five removal spells. Yeah, this deck is gas. This deck is good. This this I could see like going three out. The other deck could not three out. What what, uh, what kind of games do I design? Technically, I design? we should have wanted. Being real. And what technically means, I guess. Because literally of... our opponent punted with a kill on board. It, it, it wasn't a kill Ooh, on board. So it was I just... ask a good question on stream levels uh, as, a, as a request. What's the best magic uh, gift? Bonfire, Chion, Mageddon, or Benes, Burrito, and Bowl and Coverage. Okay, so they're all really good. Um, I want to say... If it's like magic one, it has to be the bonfire one. But I actually think the funniest one is uh, Ben S eating the the burrito on coverage. Ben S eating burrito on coverage is just like amazing. Yeah, I actually feel like uh, an article can... like a right right for CFB is just the top five ben cover is g gifts. Eating burrito. Hold on, I'm, I I can pull them all up right now. So that oh I can't Ben S eating burrito is not pulling it up. Ben Stark eating burrito. No, really? I, I can, I, I, I got you. Fire of the damned. I got you, yes. I got you. Okay. Here. I'm putting it in the chat. Wait, wait, wait. I need to be in chat to actually receive it. If I don't have it, because I don't have it open on the other, on the other dashboard. Can you do that again? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, so I have Ben S. I have bonfire here i have another one and for I you need, i need i need um chion mageddon all right throwing this in chat too is this chion mageddon yes mm -hmm. <laughs> okay so just just to take a look at all of them real quick <laughs> okay this is chion mageddon hold on just watch it from the beginning Okay, so here goes Chion. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. When it was this right? Oh, this is also this is round eight. So this is like he's not even like his first round. You can't even say that he's not. Oh my god. Okay, this is Ben S eating the burrito. So Martel and Ben S in the booth. 
He thinks they're off camera, so Venice just brings this Chipotle burrito. Tom notices, and he's like, look, and Ben is like, nope. <laughs> M- Martel doesn't even break stride. Oh, no, Martel no. Actually Martel is so cool. And col- Martel's just very cool and collected, like, always. Yeah. <laughs> and then this is Bonfire the Damned. Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. He's like, show me what you got. <laughs> the like little like hand thing is so good. The, like... One of my favorite parts about this is look at everyone's reaction here, okay? Like BDM is here. Look at Forsyth. Look at Forsyth's face. This Forsyth's yeah, face Forsyth, is amazing. BDM, you, can, you can watch like all of the... <laughs> Your face while this is going on is oh my... Also, what is this outfit? What does this do? This mustache is like Garvis L. Scott mustache. <laughs> yeah. I, that, that that mustache, you've, you've told me not to bring that one back. Yeah. Here, this one is pretty good, too. Oh, I love this one. <laughs> <laughs> that was really good, too. All right. Rejoin Q. It's like a Renaissance the, painting. Yeah, so many expressions. The bonfire one, I mean... You know, whatever bias I have because I'm in it, even though that was not like the most fun moment I've ever read, uh, I think is the best because it's so rewatchable. Yes, I have enjoyed watching it many times. Well, this is great. This is, yeah, this is just game. Like you get to go deep through, deep root warrior into Telenola's night. <laughs> what did you say? What did you say? <laughs> I think you could play Deep Root Warrior and Tell Nolly's Night. He, Luis looks like a different person in that thing because he's wearing the Garvis L. Scott mustache. Bio went from Dry Flood to Dry Back to Flood. All he manages, all anonymous. I heard that her games did not go very well. Oh, geez. Oh, okay. There, there's two drop was not, not too great. Deep Groot Warrior. <laughs> Taste it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the snipping still is on top of Louise. One second. Thanks for letting me know. I don't think I want to block this. Yeah. You, 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 you've got. Uh, We're I gonna think play that... Grazing Whiptail soon. Whip yeah. it real good. Did you see how oh, that crappy thing. that looked when it came in the battlefield? Yeah, wow, you've gone bay. Uh, yeah, I have. You, you could still attack. Oh, yeah, this gets blocked as a 3 3, huh? Yeah. I mean, or, at, yeah, at some point you might actually want to, like. Oh, boy. Because they, because they drew the ship, you might actually want to trade here. That's kind of unfortunate. So, when is that also mustache coming back? Mm. That thing is not coming back. <laughs> Who was Forsyth in that video? He's, uh,. Behind Luis. He's right behind Luis. That's not, like a, just a very funny bit of magic lore. The Bonfire remix? No, but it's not as good as the like Greater Basilisk remix. The Greater Basilisk remix is very good. That's another really good magic lore one for you. Yeah, we're getting kind of browned here. Boom! Greater Basilisk. Like... I'm gonna block here, I think, now? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Ugh. Thank God that's a command. Little do people know... Actually, I shouldn't even say it. <laughs> yes, but you should not say yeah. it. Yeah. Still draw lands. Wow. This draw went from four lands and three spells to... Eight lands and three spells in a heartbeat. You can slay. Why? You're not gonna block. I- I'm gonna block one of these. If like if if I attack with this and they just attack with this, we're probably gonna yeah. block. So they could attack with these. Well, they have to use one to crew it. Maybe they're not gonna attack with those things. Oh, uh, sure. I don't think. 
And if they do, then maybe you eat one and take some damage. I don't know. I'll pay some life to kill a card. <laughs> what shouldn't I say? X Files music. What about this? I promise you, it's better if I don't say it. Yes. You know what I'm talking about, right, Luis? Mm -hmm. Yeah. See, look at that. I have to, right? Oh yeah, easy ball. All right. We have six spells in our hand. This could be bad. <laughs> uh, well, joke's on you. No! How are you drawing so many lands? You just know. drew five lands. I'm bad oh. at this game. Yeah. You, yeah. I don't know. The truth is out there. It took me three to four lists before you could actually hear the Greater Basilisk. It's not even clear. Yeah, it's not like entirely clear that it's being Greater Basilisk is being said. It's just because it's literally just taken from the video itself. I'm not blocking this. Mm -hmm. All right, it's okay. We're gonna draw Colossal Dreadmaw right now. No, you're gonna draw Itali, the Primal Storm. Oh, that's Italy. even even better. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. God. You're not gonna win drawing like this. I'll tell you that I much. No. I might trade here, because under the assumption that you're just gonna you're gonna draw a creature this turn. We're playing when we are basic, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Joke's on cool. you. Jesus Christ. That was impressive. Yeah, I know. That was just a straight straight eight lands in a row. <laughs> pretty hard to do that. Oh, woof. Uh, based on what we saw, I think your deck... You could put in the Cacophodon, but I think this is actually okay. Yeah, this seems fine. I think I like this. I mean, the cacophony and these are not so on the dr On the draw, I think you might want to change a little bit more, but on the play, I think you can be the aggressor. Sure. Oh, yeah. Um, red car. I think that last cube draft I put up was just, like, absurdly good. Here we go. Yeah. You're never, you're never casting that Grazing Whiptail this game. <laughs> <laughs> Don't I know, say, I, I, if you say things like that, they might just come true. You realize that, right? I, I, I know how this story ends. Did you see how long that took to play the fourth? It was like a solid like two seconds. I guess I have higher up chance of like maybe if I draw three drop I want to play till Molly's night, uh -huh. right? This is close actually. Yeah, I mean I think I'd play the the veteran, but it's close. Why? I, I originally went with the veteran, but then I thought if I draw a three drop Dino, then I would like to get the pump. You only have one three drop Dino, and I think that you're more likely to get to, to attack with veteran here than than till Molly's night. And it didn't matter because yeah, we you attack them for two and play a two draw. Oh, yeah, I mean it could have mattered. I mean that kind of stuff. That kind of stuff ends up mattering. Like yeah, a lot of times, sure. I feel like people get to the end of the game and they're like, "Wow, I lost a turn in the last," or "I lost the game in the last turn." It's like, no, you like it might have been a decision on turn two or three that actually really mattered. All right, time to draw forest. All right. This is That's more than really aggressive, considering we have a hardy veteran in play. Well, yeah, but hardy veteran can't really block. Oh, that's true. Sorry, it's on my turn that it's a two-four, right? Yeah, never mind. Never mind. It's gonna be sweet if we draw. Yes. Now we're gonna. Now we're doing it. Now we're talking. Might as well send with these two punks, right? Mm hmm. Can't really block this <laughs> one, yeah. Ain't that the truth, yo? Yeah, 
Yeah, Birdman knows. There is no such thing as blocking. It's a myth. Tales of yore. We don't even want to block. I can't commission my uh, I, I, I Heart Blocks t-shirt. <laughs> I do love blocking. I think block is my favorite thing. Do your hands crack during winter? Yeah. Really? What's it like? Smooth, I guess. I'm jealous. My hands get really, really, really dry, and then they start cracking at the knuckles. That's bad. It hurts. I I had combat tricks. I really, 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 really wanted to make that shirt that said, um, uh, I had blocks, but I, I never got around to it. I do a lot of stupid stuff like that for my own entertainment. Yeah, we're running this race pretty easily, and we have some good follow-ups. You guys try out, but they don't crack. For me, it's only, like, in the knuckles, but, uh... Gosh, killing Vampire Revenant with Till Molly Knight is, like... N knuckles? Like, like from VR chat? <laughs> wow, they got to... They, they lost their... C red. Embarrassing. Just sending with all the clowns, right? Yeah, just A-space. A Do you want me to get you an A-Space emote commission? I could do that. I should do that. I should get it. Yeah, A-Space would be sweet. LSV knows the way. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite team is from Grandma's Boy. My team sucks. Yes, yeah, so that shirt is good. <laughs> oh, man, Molly. Did I do it? I really did it, I think. No, uh, you... Woof. <laughs> this ended up just being a chump block with the fireman. I guess I get to hit you for one. I don't know about all this. They're about yeah. to regret it. My hands crack horribly during winter. My first year of college, the hotter and the dryer is. My hands look thick. Cool. Yeah, death, javu. I so I what I end up having is I always have like a little like hand lotion like this um, by my desks, and then I always just put some on. But it, this is where it cracks. It's like right here and right here, yeah. and it becomes like flaky. And then after a while, it just like actually is like hurts like there's raw skin underneath it it's horrible uh this is fine but well, it's not that like that big of a deal uh sure i mean whatever we have the finisher See you, spencer finish him LSV's hat is fuego. Yeah, it is. His hat is great. I legit think you look really cute. <laughs> mm -hmm. I know I'm not the only person who thinks that. <laughs> I feel like I can't touch anything after I use hand lotion, so when do I use it? Oh, I my dad has the same thing. My dad hates using hand lotion because he feels like it makes his hands feel greasy. Even if it's not like a greasy feeling. Like, it's just like moisturized. But... Um, yeah, I don't know. It, it, it. What did they get back? Vampire Revenant, and they replayed it. Hey, you're doing fine. Yeah, I'm just a spacing. Oh, hello. Jeez. That's actually just straight up game, right? Eleven points yeah. of trample. Ha pow. Mm, so on the draw, hold on, hold on. I definitely think you want at least one fanatical firebrand. And it takes out their their three one flyer. Oh yeah, they do, and they. Yeah, and I like Cacophodon too. I think Why it's Cacophodon? just a good blocker, because they have like C red, and they put it on a two two. You can still block it with Cacophodon. Oh, it fair. also blocks their what four three thing. What would take out for this though? I think you can actually take out like two of the hardy veterans. I think on the draw you're just not gonna need those, and I think you can take out strength of the pack. You take two. We only need to take two things. Yeah, I would probably I would see if I would maybe put in like. Another firebrand instead of Hardy Veteran. 
They do have a lot of Dead Eye Tormentors. Maybe you put in, no, you don't need a Razgar after you have a, no, this looks pretty good. Sure. You could put in Swagger and Corsair, actually. Maybe that's better. Why? You're not, you're not necessarily attacking them, but. Why is this better? It seems like we're like being more defensive. But it's actually a 3-3. They have a lot of 2-2s. Two -two's. Mm. Then you could take out maybe the, the maybe just play one Firebrand. Something like that. I think this curve. Oh, oh actually, Frill Death. Gotta, this is, this has to be better. Yeah, yeah. Take out the Death Spitter. That's what you should take out. Uh, there you go. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I like this. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't, I don't think. Uh, I, I can see your Corsair thing, but I, I would be worried about it being just like a 3 minute 2 2. No, yeah, this, this is not this is great. We're, you know, we're going to draw like five lands in a row, right? Lulz. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this works out fine. You trade your one drop for their thing. I'm just going to kill it right now. Yeah, I think so. No reason to let them, like, get a raid or... I guess there's no two drop raid creatures, really, but... No, there's a chart, of course. <laughs> oh, that's annoying. Uh, I would have saved it. Stupid. Uh, no, d -man, but I am moving to Denver soon. I'm excited about that. I'm going to go look at places soon. I'm going to go look at places after JP Indy. Boom. Uh, I am playing in the modern PT, and we have not drawn Itali. We have not even seen Itali. Itali is a myth. This whole, like, mythical, legendary dinosaur. I told you we'd be drawing forest the entire time. Oof. I've been drawing pretty bad. That I like, I think. I think yeah, so, because we good. just hit this and, like, kill one of their... Yeah. It was so nice that this is a 3 3 2, because... Oh, I guess it's not. Never mind. This thing has menace. I think you just take Stupid. five this turn. Stupid. <laughs> And then play Whiptail, and hopefully you can stabilize that and way. Whip it real good. Yeah. Yo, Tartar Sauce is in Denver, and they say they love it. Itali, Itali, Itali. You need to join that. Nah, probably not, Bunny. Not, not for me. Not really. Yeah, this this looks okay. It's so awkward you've just drawn so many lands, but, you know. Hopefully uh, another... Why? Now I'm trading. Yeah, now you should trade. <sighs> no. This is so stupid. Yeah, you just draw three spells a game, then... You're not going to be able to win. All right, that's the thing. Do we do the trick? Yeah, you don't have to do it yet. You can even block and then do it. Yeah. So block here, ping here, kill this. Yeah, not quite in that order, but yeah. Well, yeah. Block here, target, hold priority, kill this. All right. Hey, well, welcome, Urza. You do need to draw, like, Atali or something, because you're just down. You know, they have five spells in their hand, and you have none. Oh. So let's go. Uh, this, this, red. I mean, there was some like nice like juking, but yeah. Look, if we draw a tally now, I think we're fine. I think we could be, yeah. I mean, it depends on what the cards are, but oh my god, so stupid, so stupid. <laughs> if they play a land here, we're super dead. If their best play was Skitter and Heartstopper, maybe they can't play much. But it doesn't actually matter. Oh yeah, we're dead. We're super dead. How many mm -hmm. how many games have we have that have been like that? Two. Two this match. <sighs> right, you just drew all lands games one yeah, and three. That was we're just... just getting the run bads out out in this game. We'll just get them out now. Oh. We well, can't can't read their messages. Why? 
honestly, there's a lot of things that tilt me about Magic Online. And I think there's a lot of things people complain about Magic Online that are, like, not that big of a deal. But not being able to see your opponent's message after, like, the match is done. That I hate. Lord Tupperware! Thank you so much for the host! And if you're coming in from the Tupperware stream, welcome! My name is Gabby, if you don't know me, and I play Magic the Gathering! We are here with... None other than, uh... <laughs> whatever this hat is, LSV. <laughs> and we are practicing some that. rivals. We are currently down a match. Gabby, stop spraying us. I'm. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for spraying you, chat. I love my compressed air so much. Is the thing. I'm gonna keep this in. Mm How -hmm. was Lord Tupperware stream? Welcome, welcome. Hey, stun luck. Welcome, raiders. I appreciate that. The hissing of snakes. Yeah. This is this is just like my snake simulator. You see. <laughs> Hey, how are you? Hey. Lord Tupperware, welcome. How was your stream? I hope your stream is going better than this draft is going for us right now. We're flooding hard. <laughs> are you trying to be Rob Alexander because you've tried nothing but lands? Did Luis lose a bet? No, nope, he is wearing that hat because he wants to, believe it or not. I think he looks cute in it. And you've answered the question of why I'm wearing it. <laughs> How do I get the honor of Viper emoji? You have to sub or so it's a sub emote. Uh, hi Gabby, big fan, no go strain, no sounds good. Thank you, less than three. The hat looks like a free gift with Monster Book of Monsters, yes. I don't know, I think it looks really cute. Uh, okay, that's fine. Like, it's kind of annoying, but it's also whatever. Mm -hmm. Pretty good 6-1 on the stream. How's RX? I'm going to treat you both. It's been fine. That was a good draw. This last match was, like, pretty frustrating. Just Oh, yeah. 20. We just drew 20 lands. So what have I done, Lord Topper? Where I went 3-0 on my first draft, 0-3 in the second one, 2-1 in the third one, 3-0 in the fourth one, 2-1 in the fifth one, I kind of want to make a 3-3. Three, three. Is that insane? Yeah, I would double, I would double, double block, block I and try to get a 3-3 three, three there. Well, actually, you know, I actually probably would just not. Oh, this is tough because you have a uh, strength left pack. So you kind of want maybe just block like this. I think this might actually be better. Yeah. Uh, tune in the fifth one and two one in the sixth one and you turn more of these than i have and right now we are oh one in the seventh one um no we just get to hunt the wheat that punk perfect perfect that was a good draw so what whatever that record is can somebody tell me what the record was i yeah. i did not keep track I think you went 3 0 3 0, 0 3 2 1 2 1 2 1 and now we're 0 1. Yeah, that's right. 3 0 0 3 2 1 3 0 2 1 2 1 0 1. Humph. There you go, Generica. Land is perfect. Yeah, we're looking good. Now, if we draw a land, we get to play a six drop, and if we draw a spell, we get to play it. The only, like, really bad draw is, like, <laughs> Italy or something. Horncrest. Oh, yeah. We're kind of doing it. See you, Awesome Bear. Welcome. Or, sorry. <laughs> See you later, Awesome Bear. Thank you for stopping in. Actually, I think now we do <laughs> send with this. Yeah. It's probably fine. Slay. What do I think about standard Merfolk? Uh, it's probably not good, but it's worth trying. I don't think it's zero percent that it ends up being good. Oh, double block? Sure. Do they have a trick? Mm 
Yeah, Luis, I only wanted to play... I've only played Rivals this week. Because I wanted to get some drafts in before the... Just send with just... this, this, and... You can, Actually, I can, send, I can send, send with, with this. Yeah, yeah, I can send with all. And then play a Death Spitter. This guy's actually not bad in the dinosaur deck. I have been okay with him. Yes, we have the random villain. We've yet to draw Knight of the Stampede or Itali, which is kind of annoying. We haven't even seen Itali. I just crashed Kamina like Bitcoin. <laughs> boots and cats and boots. Got to be confident in top four with all these dress and those seals. Well, I actually asked Luis. Okay, I'm sorry. I lied. I have played more rivals than, than I than I than I. Uh... The three O into O three were actually two sealed pools. Um. Yeah, and then the other ones have been drafts. So then there was. Not. I wish this Botura standard. That would be great. Uh, what are you playing against? You're playing against like Naya Dinos? Yeah, just Dinorinos. Probably, probably wouldn't sideboard anything yet. Oh, one. Wait. Three round seals. No. Oh, no, you're right. They were four round seals, weren't they? Mm hmm. So. So my 3 0 into 0 3 were drafts. So so I have, I have some records here that I don't remember. I have played more. Uh, finally! We're not casting it this game. Don't. Not with that attitude. Oh my god. Yeah, we're getting stuck on 3. No, 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 no. Don't say that. <laughs> yeah, so if I did play 4 round. Sealed, so my 3 0 into 0 3 had to be drafts. So there's something I'm for, like, there's some records here that I'm forgetting. I guess we'll never know your true record in Rivals Limited. Oh, somebody somebody asked me, and. It's a shame. Yep, we're, we're just never playing a fourth line this game. Stop! God, this deck is so good. It's charging monsters for two. Hey, hey, that's how we hit it, you see? I'm still blocked. I'm just attacking. You play four seal pools but didn't finish the fourth one, right? Uh, yeah, but then I, but then I couldn't have 3 0 would Molly. So, god damn. So I don't know where I'm misremembering something here. It doesn't really matter. You're gonna mill a card and then still land. Down. Land, yes. Well, it's not double green. You're being so negative. What if I actually don't want you to draw the forest? Why would you not want us to draw the forest? You don't want us to win? No, I do actually. Just play a death spitter, right? Hey, thanks, Goth. I appreciate it. There's probably a lot of people, but it's still nice to hear. Oh, that, that is that is nice. This buffalo jerky is nice too. It's very spicy. Mm, you're making me jealous. It's, it's a good follow up to ice cream. My dinner was so lame. Every time you have soy for dinner, it's like <coughs> it feels like you lost. <laughs> it doesn't feel that way when you have it for breakfast, though. No, I have breakfast. I have it for breakfast all the time. It's because I think it's. Oh boy. Well, you can beat Armistar pretty easily. <laughs> this is actual buffalo, Swanee. It's buffalo jerky. <laughs> oh, that's kind of sweet. I'm going to block. Oh, yeah. Snap block. Oh, hello. Spit in their face. Oh, man. My, my rogue in... Um... um... <laughs> Let me see you would like this. My rogue in in D and D has a level one spell that is um I mean are we just leaving this guy back on defense? 
they have an Armasaur as their last card? Yeah. Or is this their top card? Uh, it's on top. We don't know what their last card is. Yeah, I would leave it back on defense. There's no real reason to race, mm. given how good your hand is. One of my uh, one of the spells on my rogue is a spell where you have to do I forget which kind of roll, but basically all you do is you have to mock your opponent, and if you mock them properly, they take damage, <laughs> and it also get makes them roll with um, with disadvantage. <laughs> did you did you come up with some good mockings? Yeah, every time. Hey, it's Kasati. Welcome to the stream. Vicious Mockery, that's what it is, yeah! It's Vicious Mockery, yeah, Vicious Mockery is what it is. So every time I would come up with some some really stupid taunt, <laughs> make them roll with disadvantage. Because I'm a rogue, what, so then, what? What's what's Vicious Mockery like? I don't think I've ever seen it. Hmm. We could, triple, just take it. we could triple block with ease, but that sounds like it would be bad and we'd give another mm -hmm. last card. You actually could trade two things for it. Yeah, it's, pro it's like, probably fine. Block, not the monster sword, but like yeah. this, this, and this is what I was thinking. Mm -hmm. I like that I like that flavor of Vicious Mockery because it's like, it's like your words are hurting them. <laughs> it's emotionally abusive. They're monster soaring? Sure. That does look good. Yeah, look, training for a monster sword seems fine. And now we're just gonna draw a green sword. Whatever, it's okay. We still get to play Atali. Well, yeah, you might have wanted to attack with the monster sword. Why? Because they might have traded, and now now that they see Atali, they're not trading. Well, I thought I, we wouldn't want to. Do you think we actually wanted to attack there? Because yeah, I, I would still attack with monster sword. All right. Because if they attack back, you take it, then attack them back with Atali. Sure. Now I think you're gonna they're gonna trade for a totally, which is a little worse for you. Though I mean you're still gonna win the game probably. Though mm. what is this piece? Oh. oh, hello. So we just fight this thing and then send with this. Yeah, that sounds legit. We could also uh, We could also no, hunt no, no, no. here to no. here. Because then they cause then they shoot with fanatical firebrand. Oh, you're right. Mm -hmm. Gothamus, got to introduce you through LSV. I have been bitch watching your YouTube videos. A little happy I'm finally getting to catch that live stream, Goth. I'm so happy to hear that. I'm happy that you've been enjoying the live stream. I think just attack with the monster sword and see what they do. And then Itali the 5 4. Okay. Or, or, or. But if or, they block there, then we still just fight here. No, then we, that doesn't work either. Or you could actually just Itali the 5 4. With hunt the weak and then attack with both monster sword and Natali. Because that's probably best. That actually sounds fine. So here and here, right? Yeah. No, then they just ping me. Yeah, but you get plus one plus one. Oh yeah, that, that's true. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Because now you get to, like, send and... Look, they get to trade with Atali, but you get to flip two cards. You can also send with the Wayfinder, too. There's no real reason not to. Sure, I assume that they're wanting to... They will take this opportunity to trade with Atali. Swanny, I got it. Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's has good food. Yeah. I am impressed with their spread. Did they just nug you? Yeah. Fair. Well, now you can definitely send in the clowns. Oh, yeah. Hit, 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 hit! Alright. Not bad. Yeah, this card is good. This card is not bad. Yeah, this, this card's... Like, I told you that one time that I uh, hit a chupacabra off of this, I, was, I felt like I was cheating.
so now they probably have to block here. Now they have to deal with Chupa or Chupa with Monstrosaur and all these punks. I can kind of respect our opponent being on the burnout plot. I don't know. Chupasaur? We can we can we can scratch out a two one. I feel it. Hi. Good luck. Have fun. This game's great. Two three five, and the uh, wayfinder can find your four. Yeah, I'm in. I'm in. And before we, this is kind of what our hand was like when we flooded to death. Yeah, but what can you do? Not. What am I playing in not standard? Not draw so badly. Currently nothing. I wish the pro tour was standard. Then I'd be playing a lot of standard. But because it's modern, I'm not playing standard. First land. Luckily, we broke modern though, so probably get some cards banned here. Wow, land, land, nice. Oh boy. Nice. Can you just, find, just like a grazing whip tail. It's not even greedy. Uh, that seems like pretty mediocre at this point of the game. I think I would. Well, it's actually really close. This is right on the border. You probably should keep it because you can play it and the next turn go monster sword attack with both and it's like and attacks for pretty three. good. Yeah. That seems kind of medium. Yeah, it is. Measure null. Welcome to the stream. Mm hmm. Yeah, I wouldn't have kept the uh, till all his night. Mm, so Are we running in modern? You have to watch the pro tour to find out that. This is stupid. You're 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 still doing fine. We're gonna draw Tali next turn. Because just it. playing Monster Sword is such a beating. Yeah, it is. It's very good. Ooh, the last time I played in a modern pro tour, I did get cards banned, didn't I? Oh, yeah, see, like, this doesn't do anything. Lol, Knight of the Stampede. <laughs> you are so bad this time. I can't give you a hit. I don't actually know what I'm going to play. <laughs> so I just block here? Sure. I have not, not come close to something like that. Yeah, if you've played Tron in Modern, would you be happy or that he's trying to get a band? I would You're be. Not, not, not attack you. <laughs> that would be With worried, I think. Vigilance Uh, Yeah, you can't attack. Oh, yeah, they did not attack me, huh? Etali! Etali! He would be trolling if he actually played Tron. I, I, I don't. So, I, I don't. Uh, no. <laughs> no. Basically, no. Just no. Wow, your opponent's actually kind of stabilized here. Vitaly would be nice. Uh. Monster Sword is still very good. Yeah, Monster Sword is good. Wow, steadfast Armasaur is... They attacked! Browning you, really? I could triple just, block. Yeah, just triple block. All your creatures don't matter anyway. It's okay, we're about to draw a tally in a second. Yeah? Alright. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, Maybe Gabby tried to play Legacy Lands in Limited and it was the best idea! I should be playing a Lands deck. We have been flooding so hard. Okay, that, that, that actually was fine. That thing is a nightmare to attack into or, or have. Oh, come on. And we drew an. <laughs> oh, this is great. I. 
cannot right now. This is honestly fantastic. Uh, oh. The stream ends not with a bang, but a whimper. Your deck also has kind of a lot of removal. Queen's Bay agent. Uh, I think you even killed the Armasaur, actually. Yeah. At least now we're just dying to this, and this can be blocked by this. They gain life, but. Yeah. Take two. There's no modern deck I wouldn't play. If I would just play the best deck. That's all I've done. Like, it's kind of funny because like the people who only play one deck, like, whoa, you don't block there. Oh, sorry. I was looking at something else on the other monitor. Oops. Wow. No, if we had the extra life, life, we would probably have won. That is not true. <laughs> yeah, I, I am. So I am sorry. I was looking at something on the other monitor. Oh, I don't care. It's not my game. <laughs> Do you not have any investment? I mean, yeah, I do, but you don't have to apologize to me. Too, can't block too lazy. Okay, we were not no, going to win not. anyway. We would have won with an extra three life, That is I think. not true. Yeah. Could you block here? Oh, yeah, you should. <laughs> I was looking at something on the other monitor. We also just are just that. dead. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, plummet's probably okay against vampires in general. Yeah, you, have had, no dis you have no disenchants. Wow. It's, they it's had a couple of flyers, or at least we saw one. Yeah, but vamps usually, we saw two, and vamps usually like has something. Do we think that they'll have the three one? Because if they, we think so, then we might want this. But if not, we probably don't want them. Yeah, I would not. I would not side it in until I saw it. Uh, On the draw, maybe we cut this. No, yeah, I'll keep that. That one's good. What well, would you take out a hardy veteran, maybe? Oh, uh, probably not. I don't know. Maybe the frilled death spitter. This card is pretty medium. Yeah, it's just, it's just whatever. They have a lot of steadfast armosaurs. It's kind of annoying. But you have two reckless rages, two hundred. And we have the fire cannon blast to kill them too. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's draw the lands again. See if you can get there. Scary trigger Here. result before LSV second taunt. Anyways, what I was saying is some some people, some players like on the PT, just always play the same deck, and that's great when that deck's good. They they have a, high, a good chance of doing well, but. I think the players who tend to win the most lifetime are the ones who will just play the best deck at any given time. Like, Paulo's going to play White Weenie if it's the best deck, but he'll also play Blue Black Control if it's the best deck, you know? Wow. Whee! Little Raptor Hatchling. So stupid. Oh, yeah, this is the part where we just flood out horribly. I don't think I you think want I think I've been it, right? Yeah. Well, you get to play some Crown Hunters. That's kind of nice. <laughs> I, would have, I would have kept this one. See, look, there's a land here. Uh, what a joke. Oh, Hatchling's quite good. Dude. How do you even spell? Well, White Weenie is the best deck, but Wesco has better chances for sure. He plays a lot of White Weenie and will have a good list of it. If it's not the best deck, he could sometimes be in trouble, though. <laughs> wow, our mm -hmm. opponent's going off with these zealots. Yeah, you're fine, though. Just attack with both, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're kind of browning your opponent. Like, it would be nice to draw. Some big dino. Reckless Rage will also be good. This is a human, right? Yep. 
Oh well. Oh boy. Wow. That's annoying. It also got us good. Yeah. Just keep the till the this one, Tashana's Wayfinder, I guess. Yeah. Uh so choose any number of creatures you control with total power or less. Done to sacrifice the rest. So I click this one, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, we were doing so good. Yeah, we're in a little bit of trouble now. Oh, yes. Time, time for a tally. Realistically, it's time for a land. Dude, this draft has been unbelievable. Seriously. This deck's so much better than the first deck and is getting such horrendous draws and just getting <laughs> completely browned. Yeah. Okay, well, at least they can only start attacking with that thing. We have a little bit of time. And before they go, like, stupid, the 4-4 four four that you can jump. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Uh, stupid. Brick, draw land. Yes. We're drawing two drops. Sure. Sliver, no. We've been our our draws have honestly been atrocious. They have been oh, yeah. so bad. We are getting brown. Mono brown control. Actually, mm -hmm. no, no, no. Let's uh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Bam. And they have a trick. Wow, that, was, that was at least a good deal for you. Yeah, I mean, we need a tally like now. God damn it. Okay. The problem <laughs> is that we still can't, like... You can just pass. I mean, you could just kill the Armasaur if that's the one you want to kill. But then we just die Pro to the it probably fire. Is. Yeah, it's still probably better to kill the Armasaur, though. Ugh, stupid. Yeah, the cards are beating because we had creatures that are actually big. Yeah, it's total. So we don't get to just keep creatures power three or less or whatever. It's We have to keep... What does brown mean? It means we're losing badly. Tally might still get you out of this. How about land? Land well, is not going to do it, no. I wonder if Dust Legion Dreadnought is better now. I wouldn't be surprised. Why? The format's just a little slower, and so you're more likely to have like dudes and dudes like kind of chilling around. Do we just chump? Uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. I got to chump here, and then draw Tali, and they have three lands in their hand, and then. <laughs> Then we get there. All right. Well, we get to kill the flyer at least. Yeah, but then we got hit for four. This is true. Wait, did they not crew it with the Dusk Legion Zealots? They also didn't crew it with the right creature, no. Ooh, okay, that was... That was technology. I also believe we are super dead, actually. <laughs> well then... <laughs> Yeah, they probably had it in their hand the whole time waiting for you to play one of your 6-6s. Six God, we were getting sandbagged by our opponent. I honestly thought this deck was great, Luis. I thought we were going to... Yeah, we're dead. Yeah, I thought we were going to, like, 3-0 with this deck. I thought, I mean, we're still most likely to 2-1, to but yeah. Getting, well, okay, go, I'm one, sorry. One, I, I don't mean to say that I thought we were going to 3-1 or 3-0. 3-1 would be uh, something. I thought that we had a really good chance to 3 0 with this deck, is yeah. more what I meant. Um, but instead, we just did not get there at all. <laughs>
did enough to get there. Um. All right. I think I'm gonna call it here. Uh, let me wrap up the video in case we end up using it. If you're watching this on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you like this video, you can like and subscribe for more. Uh, you can see them on youtube.com slash gabbysparts. And if you wanna catch the stream live, you can go to twitch.tv slash gabbysparts. I stream every weekday in the afternoons central times. Thanks for watching YouTube, see you later.